everybody, Bless Chick here. Today we're taking a look at this lunchbox set by Pinnacle. Before I start, I just want to say that uh, this is a reorder, it's a reshipment because my first order arrived with mold on uh, the all over it actually, it was everywhere. Um, and I talked to the seller who is really understanding, really nice. I reached out to him and he explained that like 600,000, some, a huge amount, might not be that much, I'm not looking at the email, but a huge amount of inventory was damaged in shipment. And so a lot of these went out to customers with him unaware that they had been damaged. Uh, they were, they got wet in shipping and mildew began to grow all over them. And so um, you may see a lot of comments and uh, feedback specifically talking about the mildew on these lunch boxes. And if you get a unit that arrives that way, all you need to do is reach out to the seller, contact him, let him know, show him pictures or video, and he will replace that because he's trying to get, take everything, uh, you know, make it right. He, of course, wants his items to go out, quality items, which they are. Um, you may also see um, some people stating that the thermos leaks, but the thermos does not leak. And I'll show you my trick that I use. Um, sometimes if you don't get something, any kind of jar, if you don't get it aligned perfectly, you think it will. You put it on and you think, oh, it's good, but it might not be. Even on this shot, I got it. But let me show you what I do when, um, and, and it doesn't always work, but usually it does. The trick is when you go to put a lid on something and you have trouble getting it aligned, instead of trying to figure that out, start by going backwards on it. That sort of kind of clicks it into place. When you go backwards on it, you can sort of hear that click. That means now you're on track and then you can screw it in. So I tested this because my kids obviously take their lunch to school sometimes too. And if I sent a thermos filled with soup or a drink inside of it and it were to leak out during the uh, day, it would ruin all the things in their backpack. It would be a great cause of embarrassment. It would just be flat out bad. So um, I did test it on its side, filled with water, and I tested it upside down as well, both with the lid and without, and no water leaked. So as long as you have it completely sealed the right way, and use that trick if you have to, um, it's fairly easy to get this in and out. When it's open, of course, it's going to leak, but otherwise you do get a tight seal. The bag itself is really nice. Uh, and it comes with three color-coordinated forks, a uh, fork, a knife, and a spoon. You've got a spot here for a napkin. And then you have two separate um, containers here. You open these little, these are almost like little bento boxes. This one is completely sealed. This is where you're going to put either your cold or hot items. Um, you know, my son likes to have lasagna in particular, and my daughter likes parfaits. So I would use this for those and you just line this up it's very easy even your kid can put it back together goes in like this and it also does not leak and then you've got one more right here and this one is more for your dry goods like fruit um, crackers uh, any type of cut apples snacks can go in here the uh, this is not the stainless steel one uh, I do want to also point out that this is not dishwasher safe. Do not immerse, you know, when you're washing them, and you have a warning sticker right there on the back too. Do not immerse in water, hand wash only. Uh, of course, you you know, you're going to immerse it, but it, for the stainless steel one, I believe, is what they're mainly talking about. But yes, you do not want to run these through the dishwasher. It will ruin them. Hand wash only. You put them in just like that. You've got a little extra room for maybe a couple more snacks if, if you want to put right here. And then you simply fold it up and it zips right up. And you've got the perfect lunchbox with handle. And that is somewhat adjustable. That's about as long as it gets. And you can make it shorter. So thank you so much for watching. I love this. It's five stars. Um, like I said, the seller was quick to... Uh, make it right with the mildew and now you can see we have a perfectly beautiful lunch bag no issues thank you so much hope you have a great day bye bye